Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and this is a quick tips and tricks. Um, I've been asked a few times, I've talked about it in the past, but uh, sometimes, you know, a little refresh, especially with the latest versions of Windows on uh, how to uh, check this out. Um, quite a few of you have been asking me, where do I go to know what uh, programs are starting with my computer? Some of you have noticed sometimes that, uh, you know, boot up is longer. Uh, and a lot of it could be the software that actually is also starting up. As you install new programs, a lot of them like to have a little, you know, module that starts with your PC. The reason why they do this often is because it makes the um, startup time of the app or the program um, shorter. So it means that when you click on the icon, the uh, program actually starts faster but the problem is it also can make your pc take a longer time to boot up when you actually start so to see where and what uh, are the startup programs two places now if you're in an older version of windows 10 you'll have one place which is in the task manager right click on the taskbar go to the task manager and then on the top of the task manager, you have something called startup. Click startup. And here you will see all the apps that are starting with your PC. Here you can disable what you don't need, what you don't want. It depends what you are using. Word of caution, disable them one at a time, restart and see if everything's all right. Like that, if something isn't right, or something goes wrong, you'll know which one that you actually uh, disabled that you will want to enable. Of course, you don't disable your security apps or notifications from these apps. Um, so you want to have the least amount of startup items as possible so that everything actually works fine. For the other place, if you are on the May 2020 update, and I believe this is possibly available also on the 1903-1909 versions, you could go into your settings app. In the settings, you have apps, and on the left side, you'll see something called startup. And here, you should see the same apps that you had in the task manager. But I'm showing both so that if you don't see startup on this list, because this was not on every version of Windows 10, I believe, then you could go to the task manager to do it. And here, well, you have the on off switches that tell you how long it takes for um, the uh, different um, you know, t t apps to actually start up. Sometimes it will say not measured, depending on what app it is. Sometimes it will say the impact is low or moderate or high of course high impact means that it takes much longer to actually start up so those are the ones you might actually want to remove and um, there's of course the uh, moderate impact also so try to keep this list as short as possible and by having that you will uh, make sure that your pc starts uh, the fastest possible. Uh, in general, what you want is to have the minimum amount of apps that start up with your PC. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.